Welcome to our lecture online. In the previous video, we calculated the gain of a transfer function in terms of decibels or the decibel scale. And this is the equation that we got. The gain in decibels is equal to 10 times the log of the ratio of the power. But how do we calculate the gain in decibels for voltage or current? Well, we know that the relationship between power and current can be equated that P equals I squared times R. And from Ohm's law, since I equals V over R, when we replace I by V over R and we have the quantity squared, power then becomes V squared divided by R, which means that we can then find the gain as being 10 times the log of the ratio of V squared over R for the final over the initial. And then of course, if we separate things a little bit, we can write as 10 times the log of the ratio of the voltage, V2 over V1 squared, times the ratio of the, of the resistance, R1 over R2. Notice since R is in the denominator, we have to, of course, switch that to turn into a multiplication. And then using the rules of logarithms, the logarithm of a product is equal to the individual logs summed together. So this becomes 10 times the log of the ratios of the voltage squared plus 10 times the log of the ratio of the resistances. Obviously, you have R1 over R2. And then if we want to get R2 on the top, we change this to a negative. So this then becomes that the gain is 20 times the log of the ratio of the voltages minus 10 times the log of the ratio of the resistance. All we did here is take the exponent and multiply the 10, make that into a 20. Now, quite often, the input resistance, the output resistance is the same. And so if that's the case, the log of 1 is equal to 0. This term drops off. And we can simply simplify it that the gain is 20 times the log of the ratio of the voltages. And since the power is proportional to I squared, we can come up with the same kind of relationship for the current. And so we can say that the gain for the current is equal to 20 times the log of the output current over the input current. So now we have three equations. We have one for the gain when we use power, and we have equations we we'll use gain when we have voltages, or the gain when we have the current. And this is what we call the decibel scale for the gain for power, voltage, or current. And notice the difference. We only have a 10 in front when we have power, or 20 when we have voltage or the current. And then later on in later videos, we'll show you how to use this to calculate the gain and to calculate or to come up with the bold plots. And that's the thing we need to do next. And that is how it's done.